scientists are so scared by what we know that we are prepared to risk arrest to, um, to try and do something about it. I'm pasting two papers today. One is a projection of what climate change means for human beings, and it, it's incredibly concerning. It shows that places where one third of the global population currently live will be uninhabitable by 2070. The other paper I'm pasting is about the ecological crisis, and it says that things are so bad that to do something about this, scientists need to go beyond our normal roles, and we need to be brutally honest with, with society, with the world, about how bad things are. Parts of the world are becoming inhospitable to life, and that is evil and that's cruel, and New Thought is highly instrumental in this. This, of course, is the, the biggest news that the world has ever faced or will ever face, and yet the mainstream media don't treat it as news. The media um, get them, their revenues primarily from advertising, and that means they're very reluctant to perpetuate messages that run counter to the messages their advertisers are paying them to spread. So take, for example, the automobile industry or the tourism industry. These are both high-carbon industries, and they are major, major advertisers. If you flick through a newspaper and look at the adverts, half of them will be for holidays or cars. So the message is, is completely counter to the message that newspapers should be sharing, which is that we need to change everything. But by carrying these adverts, they're sharing the message that we can just carry on consuming as normal and you know, ignoring these problems. And that, that's a dangerous message.